right, so um, after the palaver with the, with the masking tape issue on the mud guards and the feathering, <coughs> I said I probably had like one or two main options. One was to reline it and repaint it, and the other was to do a, a micro transfer layer, um, like a thin, uh, thin vinyl layer. Anyway, I was just going around the house and I had this to the side. Now, this is a, it's designed as a wall decal. Um, you get them all over the internet. I've got three or four of them up around the house. Um, they come in lots of different bits and it's basically a two level kind of backing sheet and plastic. You can see the two different levels there um, that, that peel off. Now they're really, really thin, uh, the front layer is anyway, and they stick really well and they look really smooth. So what I did was took some some proper um, card cutting scissors which I had laying about and I basically cut a strip, well two strips, off the entire length of uh, one side and then another couple of strips and you can see here cut out of the top edge and then as you can see here I took another one so I basically had four, five, six strips all in all and after applying them I ended up with this. So as you can see, it ended up coming out really, really nicely. A little bit of damage there, but that doesn't matter because it'll be underneath um, a bolt. Anyway, so there's one. He says out of focus when the camera refocuses. That's one of them. And the second one, that's it. Same kind of thing, except this one I did in two parts, so it separates in the middle. Um, got a slight fold over on each end. Doesn't matter too much because you'll never really see it because it'll be underneath by the wheel. The point was, all I wanted to make sure was that when you look at it from either top on or from the side, it's covered like I want. So. Logistically speaking, I'm really, I'm really happy with both of those. Really good in the end.